I am often asked if BTI is dangerous for humans or animals. The World Health Organization requested research studies on this product, and most of these researches show, unambiguously, that BTI has no effect on humans or on animals. Humans have an acid pH that preserves the crystals. Therefore, the crystals won't dissolve in the intestine. It is the same, for example, for birds. People think that because BTI is applied in pellets, birds will eat them and die. But scientific studies have proven that it doesn't work that way. Birds will indeed eat the pellets, but they will excrete BTI in feces. What will happen if we remove mosquitoes? What will happen to birds? What will happen to bats and frogs? Again, studies have been conducted. There's not many of them, but there are good ones that show that birds eat little mosquitoes. It is the same for bats. You may notice that bats are active at night when mosquitoes disappear. Studies were conducted on stomach content of birds, bats, and even frogs in Germany. And it was found that approximately 5% consisted of nematocera, which include mosquitoes. These results were obtained in a period of very dense mosquito populations. What is important to understand is that large-scale treatments conducted in Quebec, in Ontario, and in other places around the world are done by companies with expertise in this field. They are experts. Therefore, we must place our trust in these people. We trust experts in accounting, in economy, etc. And I think that people who do the treatments must be approved by the government. So they have to demonstrate their level of expertise. And I think it's a good thing for the population to know that these people are professionals in their field of activity. The ingredient was accidentally discovered in Israel and it was noticed that it killed mosquito larva. Today, we know how it works. When the bacterium grows in its environment, at the end of its cycle, it bursts. During its cycle, it produces something we call a protein crystal, which is like a pellet in the bacterium that is insoluble in water. The mosquito larva, among others, like the black fly larva, are filter feeders. So if we put these small pellets in the water, they will filter them. Therefore, the pellet will find itself inside the larva intestine. And inside the larva intestine, another particularity or specificity of BTI, those two diphtheria family that are mosquitoes and black flies, have a very high intestinal pH. It's like Drano, the product that is used to clean toilet or sink drains. It is very alkaline and it is specific to mosquitoes and black flies. What will happen is that the crystal, that is usually insoluble, will dissolve in the intestine with the chemical mechanisms, the pH, and the enzymes. As a result, four products, four proteins, will be released in the intestine and three of them will stick to the intestinal cells and make them burst. Therefore, in a short amount of time, it can take 20 minutes, half an hour maximum, the larva will die since it doesn't have an intestine anymore. That is how this product works, and its specificity comes from the very high intestinal pH, which is very important since it is found in few organisms and from the fact that it requires filtering, so it needs filter feeding organisms. That is why I consider this product to be environmentally friendly.